Good morning, everyone. My name is Shimon Adebumi, and welcome to the Wednesday Word of the Week. This morning, I'd like to share a scripture with you that I really love to meditate upon. It's from the book of 1 John chapter 5 and verses 21. 1 John chapter 5 and verses 21. I'll read it from the New Living Translation. It says, Dear children, keep away from anything that might take God's place in your hearts. Dear children, keep away from anything that might take God's place in your heart. This morning, I'd like us to pray with that scripture. I'd like us to pray so that nothing will take the place of God in our hearts. I'd like us to lift up our voice this morning and say, Father, I thank you for shedding light into my heart this morning concerning things that can take my heart away from you in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you for shedding light on the things that can take my heart away from you. Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you. I bless and magnify your name because today you have shed light on the things that I must be careful of, of the things I must abstain from, of the things I must run away from and flee from in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you because the entrance of your word gives light and it gives understanding to the simple. I thank you today, Heavenly Father, because you have shed light on this things in Jesus precious name we pray it says dear children keep away from anything that might take God's place in your heart so I want us to pray this morning father in the name of Jesus give me the strength to flee from all forms of evil give me the strength to kick away everything that may take your place in my heart in the name of Jesus let it not be tasteful to me in the name of Jesus let me not be attracted to the things that will cause me into damnation father I pray in the name of Jesus that whatsoever my heart longs for that is not you father in the name of Jesus help me help me deliver me from them in Jesus mighty name we have prayed that scripture again says from anything that might take God's place I want us to pray one more prayer father let me not place anything in your stead in the name of Jesus let me not replace you with anything not with wealth not with relationships not with material things in the name of Jesus father help me help me not to replace you with anything in the name of Jesus I declare you are my Lord I declare you are the head of my life I declare you are my pillar in the mighty name of Jesus you are my my shepherd, you guide me continually in Jesus' precious name. We pray. I want us just to give God thanks this morning for the for this month of May. I want us to thank God for deliverances, thank Him for healing, thank Him for your salvation afresh. Thank Him because He is God and there is none like Him. Thank Him because He stands in a place where nothing can exchange Him in your life. Father, I thank you. I thank you because you are good. I thank you because your mercy endured forever. I thank you because in this month of May, you are removing everything that is striving to take your place in my life. You are God and God forever. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In Jesus' precious name, we have prayed. Thank you very much for joining us this morning for the Wednesday Word of the Week. I thank you again because God is doing great and marvelous things. I pray that this month of May, your testimonies would increase in the name of Jesus. God bless you and have a fantastic day, week, and month. God bless you.